Hello and welcome to this new moon meditation in February the 1st, 2022. As we've left the last couple of days in Mercury retrograde, which has probably been zapping your energy and making it seemingly impossible to move forward since the middle of January, you'll be thrilled now to know that there's a whole new vibe that's coming your way. Its ability right from off the bat for the first month is going to bring in a new moon which is fixed with the air sign Aquarius. A new moon is the astrological counterpoint. It illuminates, it's illuminated by the sun, but from our perspective on Earth, the new moon is hosted by a deep, dark, blank slate sky. And the new moon is very much there to offer you. The opportunity is a visioning board to have that clear space to bring the things in, the chapters you'd like to write, the book you'd like to open. And the fixed air sign Aquarius symbolises that this is a time now for change. It's a time for networking, it's a time for collaboration, coming together with people. People who are like-minded, people who you have that resonation with. It's a time to be generally progressive, future-minded, humanitarian and social. It's there to adopt and, and amplify the platonic relationships and create things really that you know really resonate with you and they march and they sound to the beat of your drum. As we know in our lives there are plenty of no's but now is a time for you to really look forward Remove those limitations and boundaries and commit yourself to you and to you going forward. It's a time now to turn in and direct yourself and really allow a lot of the self-reflection to disappear. It no longer serves you. The habits of the past can only cause problems for the future. Getting clear on your hopes and dreams and strengthen the belief in yourself is a way to have a promising path forward. This moon is very community orientated. It challenges you to reflect on the people who give you energy and the ones that don't. And the friendships that are worthy of your energy and the ones that are no longer. It's time for you to break free. It's time for you to really move forward into this much more lunar energetic state. And understand what you'd like to manifest now can be the wishes of your everyday reality. I'd like you now to close your eyes. And if you're doing this meditation in the darkness of the new moon. I want you to take a deep breath in and as you do, as you're breathing in, I want you to push out your awareness so it feels as if you're connecting with the external energies of the earth, of the energies that are all around you. And as you breathe out, you feel yourself just sinking into this wonderful space, allowing the new moon vibration to allow you to put your ideas out to the universe, to dream big, to create actions towards your goals and embrace the potent energy of a new moon. It's time for you to manifest your soul purpose. When you take a deep breath in, I want you to hold it for a second, but this time I want you to bring your awareness to your soul, to your higher self, to your heart, to that place that creates calm, it has love, it has faith. It's a place with no fear. It's a place of compassion. It's a space where you can be yourself. Unconditional. And just naturally follow your own breath. 
just allowing yourself to breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth and activate your parasympathetic nervous system to signal to your body that it's time to slow down, it's time to relax, it's time to restore your energy in this beautiful and very powerful new moon meditation. Feel yourself just settling in, feeling calm, feeling blessed, feeling loved. And I know you, I want you to imagine yourself in many ways sat in a deck chair on a mountainside or a hill on a really warm summer's evening, clear sky with no light pollution whatsoever. There looks to be a million stars around you. There's no moon. You can't see it. It creates this wonderful space, this beautiful charcoal grey all around you. The perfect canvas to project everything that you would like and more over this coming month. And as you sit in this deck chair looking out at the stars, I would like you to say to yourself and fill the gap in the next month, I would like to bring more what into my life. Fill the gap yourself. But you sat on that chair, looking up to the stars, sending out your manifestation. In the next month, I would like to bring more what into my life. And just see the stars twinkle as you send out that manifestation. See them aligning, bringing back the universal energy of love and faith. And as you feel that energy returning to you, just say to yourself, this month, I hope that that, what is that? What would you like to happen this month? What do you hope for this month? What are you hoping happens? What are you hoping appears? What are you hoping that the universe brings to you? This month, I hope that, and send out your manifestation, send out your thoughts that beautiful canvas in front of you in your mind sat there with everything in front of you say this me this month I need what what do you need this month Send it out there. What boundaries are you setting for yourself? What boundaries are you putting between yourself and the people around you? How are you protecting yourself? Ask the universe for what you need at this, full, this new moon and stand in that power. This month I need what? Just follow your breathing and... Let's really push some manifestation out there now in this beautiful February new moon, the moon of Aquarius. And my wildest dreams on this earth is to what? Say to yourself, my wildest dream on this earth is to what? And give yourself permission. Give your permission to see what you desire right now. The biggest, the wildest dream that you have inside you. It doesn't matter if you think it's unattainable, it feels or seems, whatever it is, don't hold back. Release the fear, release the expectation, release the judgment. And again, allow yourself to see this wildest dream, visualize in front of you in this beautiful night sky. And how are you going to get there? Why not think of three actions that will start you on your journey towards your dream? Think about that. Send those actions. Send the things that you need to do to start you on this journey. Often we look at the distance between where we are now and our wildest dreams. And that space and that gap can feel very intimidating. And I encourage you not to compare where you are now 
to where you dream yourself to be. Just let your dream inspire you. Let your dream just take the next few steps in that direction. Don't look up at the staircase. Focus on the step in front of you and give it everything you have. What little steps you can take this month to move in the direct direction of your dream. Is there a conversation you need? Is there a course you need to enroll? Is there a routine you need to adhere to? What do you need to do? But take some time to really visualise the actionable steps to move you on your way. And visualise yourself achieving this dream. And when you move towards that achievement of being and imagining the dream fulfilling and coming true, how do you feel? See that manifestation happening. How does it feel? What words come to your mind when you think about moving towards reaching the dreams of yours? How does it make you feel? What words come to mind? If you're not feeling much, just take a few more deep breaths and and see your dream again. There are no limits to the dreams you can have. Just as long as you're honest with yourself and you give yourself permission to believe it is possible. You don't need to know how or when it will happen. You just need to think about what your dream is and then it will happen. With your eyes closed now, you're gonna imagine it to be true. Your wildest dream, the one you're drawn to most. Our bodies are objective and really can tell the difference between thoughts of something happening and the reality of something happening. So the reactions within our body are the same. If you truly tune your thoughts and visions into that dream, the power lies in the fact that you consciously raise your vibrations to the frequency of your dream. And when you continue to vibrate at this frequency, your dreams and steps will become more to you. We know that when we vibrate on a certain frequency, we attract things of that frequency. Just feel that energy. You can see yourself sat there with everything going on around you. The stars are aligning and manifesting is taking place. You can feel and sense it. You know that February is going to be the month for you. You know that now you are stepping into a new chapter of your life. And you're ready to release all your fears, your limitations and your beliefs that no longer serve you. So that you can step into your power. Step into your dreams. And you're capable of achieving anything you want to. You must just start by believing now as we sit here believing your manifestation in this wonderful new moon just allow the energy just to wash over you to take away everything that no longer serves you to sit in that powerful energy of you being you the time for you to step into your energy to step into your power no more procrastination, no more thinking. Today is your first step forward. And take it with the love and joy that the universe is all around you. Send your thoughts out to the fifth dimensional vibration that you know will bring back everything that you so desire. Everything that you want that has integrity and love based around it. And when you're ready, you can just take a deep breath in. Wiggle your fingers and come back into the room. Thank you for joining me and I hope that you have a wonderful new moon this evening. This meditation can be used anytime, not just for a new moon. If you want to manifest and align your higher self, then this is the time to do it. Thank you for listening. Have a wonderful day. Take care. Be love and give love. Bye-bye.